Hello everybody, this is Shukri on and welcome to chapter 2 of the summer edition. If your watermelon nails are still not making you feel better, I am sure these water containers will. So without further ado, let's get into how to DIY these watermelon mason jar and bottle. For the first DIY, you are going to need a mason jar, glass paint, sponge and 3D outliner in black color. So first take the mason jar and since we want to paint the bottom with green color, put some paint directly onto the jar and start dabbing the sponge onto the paint. Make sure that you are doing it evenly and the paint does not go out of the portion you have planned to paint green. Once you are done, let it dry for a few minutes. If you are not sure with your judgement, you may use a washi tape to cover the area to be protected. Next I need a small transition stripe of white colour and so I am doing the same thing with white paint. Later repeat the same process with pink or red glass paint. I started off with pink glass paint but later I found that it would look better in red so I just put some red paint onto the pink glass paint and started dabbing it with the sponge. Once you are done, let it dry for few minutes. Next, take the 3D outliner in black color and start making tear shaped seeds on the red portion. Make as many seeds you want and let it dry for some time. I was not really okay with the green at the bottom so I just used a yellow color on the bottom near white to make it ombre. Also I have missed on the part where you need to apply acrylic varnish on the glass paint when you are done in order to seal it from wearing off. So do not forget acrylic varnish. And finally, the watermelon mason jar is done. For the next DIY, all the supplies are same except that you need acrylic paint instead of glass paint and your plastic bottle. So I started off by taking some green paint in the dish and using the sponge, I started dabbing the green on the bottom of the bottle. I am doing it very randomly and not filling the grooves because I like it that way more. Now take white color and using another piece of sponge dab it on the bottle. After this I am using the sponge with green color and with just the previous paint still on the sponge dabbing it near the border of white color for the smooth transition 
और ओमरे रिपीट द सेम प्रोसेस विद पिंक एक्रेलिक पेंट आई एम मेकिंग श्योर दैट हाफ ऑफ माई बॉटल इज हैविंग द पिंक कलर टैप 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 योर पेंट ऑन द बॉटल एंड लेट इट ड्राई फॉर सम टाइम नेक्स्ट मेक सम सीड्स विद द ब्लैक थ्री डी आउट लाइनर फॉर द वॉटर मेलन I love how cute these seeds look on the pink portion. Once you are done with all the seeds, do not forget to apply acrylic varnish to the bottle as well. It's very very important guys and this would give a glossy finish to the bottle. Also wash by scrubbing gently otherwise the paint might come out. So this is how it looks and I think it's pretty cute. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and do give it a thumbs up if you like it also if you haven't subscribed please subscribe guys and the previous chapter of the summer edit is right here go and watch it and i'll see you in my next video bye